Here comes the field for race 10, opening leg of the final pick three. Number one, Going Like Sam, owned by Richard Elwood, driven by David Miller. Two is Sam with Style, owned with a for profit two stable with Jody Yessing. Three, Indian Fever, owned by Pell Pack Stables with David Hawk. Four, Moonlight Silver, owned by J.D. Burnett and the driver Chip Noble. Five is Childhood's End, owned by Charlie Stillings, Tony Marino, and Dean Egret, driven by J. Cross Six Workplace, owned by Dick and Carol McCumber with Ed Mullinax. Happy birthday to driver Ricky McCumber Jr. and Seven Gifted Ruler, owned by John and Diana Ackley. Brad Hanners will be in the sulky. That is the field for today's 10th race, post time in six minutes. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off in pacing. Workplace on the far outside. Quickly on the rail. Going like Sam. Indian Fever kicks out. Moonlight Silver is in the center. As they race four deep to the far turn. Moonlight Silver caught between horses with a short lead. Indian Fever. Workplace on the outside. And going like Sam. Make their way to the quarter mile pole. Sandwich style after that gifted ruler in childhood's end. Moving by the opening quarter, a solid 26 and three fifths. A murderous tempo in the 10th. Past the stands, it's Indian Fever by a length. Jumping off straight on the outside. Workplace, the six is on a break. Around the paddock, turn to the half mile pole. Indian Fever continues to lead the way by an easy length and a half. Stalking in second, Moonlight Silver. Two more lengths to go in like Sam as they hit the half mile pole. After that, Sam was style. Swinging up on the outside, gifted ruler from the back. Childhood's end, and at the end, it's Workplace, who is still off stride. 55 and 1, flying past the 5 8. Bouncing right along, it's Indian Fever. Indian Fever by two, Moonlight Silver, second three parts of a length. Gifted ruler uncovered, going like Sam needs racing room. Far outside, childhood's end. After that, Sam with style and workplace. But getting away on the front end, it's Indian Fever, 124 and 3. Track record for two year old Colts is 153 and 2. He's got a shot at it. He has opened up a 10 length lead, turning for home. Indian Fever on top by a dozen raw on a side of slides all alone. Indian Fever, his only competition is the clock. Deep stretch, it's Indian Fever going like Sam. Indian Fever, 153 track record, two-year-old pacing Colts. Result of race 10 is now official. 3-1 exact of $45.40, 45 $45.40. Trifecta $215 even. Windows are now open on today's 11th race. Randy Tharps will drive number six, our big cat. Randy Tharps to drive the six. The also's have been released. Thunder Dan, let go. AE2, go nuclear. Both these guys have been scratched because the field remained intact. Here comes the connections of number three, Indian Fever trainer Dave Stratton, driver Dave Hawk. Teaming up today for a track record for two-year-old pacing Colts in 153. He's by Noble and Sam out of Hay Lady, owned in Ottawa by the Pal Pack Stables. Trained by David Stratton, driven coast to coast by the Hawkman. Covering the mound 153-3, Indian Fever the winner. And Scioto Downs is honored to have in the winner's circle Dick and Betty Brandt, gracious host of our Backstretch Tours. Dick, longtime driver trainer here in Ohio. And Betty, one of the stalwarts of the sulky sweeties. Dick and Betty Brandt meeting Team Indian Fever in the winner's circle. Post time, 539.
Top gun in race 10, going like Sam second. Sam with style fifth, Indian Fever the winner. Moonlight Silver was third, Childhoods and sixth, Workplace seventh, Gifted Ruler fourth. Two, five, one, three, six, seven, four on the bottom of the mile, 153.